you know, the military, you have a very regimented lifestyle. You, you know exactly what's going to happen. And in police work, you don't. You just know that a, a call's going to come in and you're going to go take care of it and you're going to hope that nobody gets hurt. As a police officer, same, same as with being a Marine, so you have to be similar to a coiled snake. A coiled snake looks on the um, on the outside of it doesn't look very dangerous. It just comes out. But at any given moment, it has to be ready to strike. As a police officer, you have to, you have to be steady. You have to be ready. You have to be um, prepared at any given time to strike back. As, a, as an infantryman, you're out patrolling with, you know, generally as a 13-man squad, so you've got 12 other guys with you who are carrying semi-automatic rifles, fully automatic uh, machine guns, grenade launchers. Uh, as a police officer, I go out there, I'm generally one man or with my partner. I'm working with a... Uh, with the citizens, you know, hopefully they're, you know, if something does come, come down, you know, you'd hope that, you know, some citizens would help you out. Uh, have to, as a police officer, um, fall back on your training, uh, your experiences, knowing that how you talk to people and how you present yourself carries a lot of weight with how they're going to act.